what are reciprocals? Hey, I'm Jason Jacobs. This is Math with Jason Jacobs. I'm gonna teach you all about reciprocals, which is gonna help you learn how to divide fractions. Here we go. So, uh, what's the reciprocal of one half? Well, that's where the numerator and denominator, you just, you just flip them, okay? So, the reciprocal of one half is two over one. Notice they just flip. And what a reciprocal means would be um, the product of a reciprocal would equal one. So like one times two is two, and two times one is two, and two over two equals one. So there is a reciprocal as long as uh, this is not a zero. So what's the reciprocal of two thirds? Well, you just flip them, so that would be uh, three halves. I don't put an equal sign there because two thirds is not equal three halves, so I don't know what kind of sign you put there. But the reciprocal of two thirds is three halves. What's the reciprocal of one fourth? Well, four over one or just four, because four is assumed four over one. So the reciprocal of one fourth is four, or four over one you could, is still accurate. What's the reciprocal of five? Well, assume that five is five over one, right? And the reciprocal of five is one fifth, just like that. So the reciprocal of five is one fifth, the reciprocal of six is one six. Make sense? Okay, what's the reciprocal of one in one half? Ha <laughs> ha, now we're getting a little tricky. First convert it to an improper fraction. Two times one is two, plus one is three halves. So three halves, and the reciprocal of three halves is two thirds. So the reciprocal of one and one half is two thirds. First convert the mixed number into an improper fraction. Then once it's in an improper fraction, you can do your business and reciprocate it. Okay, why is this important? Well, with long division, let me show you long division, uh, not long division, with dividing fractions, I'll just give you a quick example. Three fourths divided by one half. So when you're dividing fractions, dividend, divisor, quotient. Dividend is the fraction being divided or the number being divided. Divisor is doing the dividing and the quotient is the answer to the division problem. So the dividend stays the same. So three fourths stays the same. Then you multiply by the reciprocal. Again, flip flopping the numerator and denominator, just like so, and you get six fourths, which equals one and two fourths, which equals one and one half, which is equal to the quotient of these. Here's how I like to remember it. Left side, leave it, middle multiply, right side, reciprocate. Left side, three fourths, we will leave it. Middle, multiply, right side, reciprocate. These were improper fractions, you would, or mixed numbers, you would convert them to improper fractions first, and then do the reciprocal, just like this, to find the quotient here. The, so the quotient is equal to the product of its reciprocal, if that makes any sense. Just follow the algorithm. All right, thanks guys.